Hi guys, welcome to my video. My name is Lisa and in this video, I will be showing you guys on how to create your own light using Adobe Lightroom. So before we get started, what you want to do is you want to make sure to download the light generator. I've already done that. The installation is very easy. The link to the download will be in the description below. So after the installation, this is what the LUT generator looks like. Now let's jump into your video editing software. I use Final Cut Pro and what you want to do now is to take a screenshot of your video you want to color grade. I've already done this task and generally what I like to do is to take a screenshot of a scene that has skin tones in it. Alright, so here is my screenshot. I've already imported into Adobe Lightroom and now what we're going to do is color grade the screenshot. I do use a preset that I created my own and I just do minor tweaks. And once you are done color grading, right click on the photo. You go into settings and you copy settings. You want to make sure to disable the following. So you want to disable clarity, sharpening, local adjustments, noise reduction, effects, spot removal, and crop. Right, so now open the LUT generator. You go to the upper left corner, so click LUT generator. Go into preferences and you want to choose the size of the LUT. And so 3D LUT 25 is usually enough, so click 3D LUT 25. Now close. And now what you want to do is generate a hull. So just click generate a hull, place it into a folder where you will be able to find it. So I'm going to place mine under LS LUTs. Now open. Go back into Lightroom. Now import the hull. You go into the develop tab, right click on the photo, go into settings and you paste settings. Right click on the photo again and then we're going to export it as a JPEG. So right click, go into export. You want to make sure that the quality is set at 100. The color space is set at sRGB. The resolution is set at 72. Now we're going to export it place into a folder where you will be able to find it. So now you open the LUT generator again, you click convert to cube, click the JPEG file, now open, and there now your LUT has been created. Now let's jump back into your video editing software. So I'll go back into Final Cut Pro, and what you want to do now is basically color grading. So I'm going to add an adjustment layer on top of the clip and I use MLUT. So I'm going to load custom LUT. You go into the folder where you place your LUTs and you choose the cube file. Now you click load. So I'm going to lower the intensity. I think 100% is too much sometimes, so I generally like upload it to maybe 80%. And when you want to create more LUTs, you don't have to create another haul. All you have to do is edit and color grade another photo, copy settings, and paste it into the same haul, and then repeat the same steps again. And there you have it, your own LUT. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you guys in the next video.